626 on the clock, and this morning, my guest is the new executive director of the Lafayette Symphony Orchestra, Sarah Mummy, and she's here to talk about a very exciting new concert. But of course, we want to congratulate you on your new position. Thank you so much. Tell us a little bit about, you know, what you plan on doing in your new role. Mm -hmm. There's a lot of change coming for the Lafayette Symphony. We're particularly excited about our 2012-2013 season that'll start this coming September. Uh, it's going to bring a lot of outstanding guest artists, some really innovative programming, and I think it's something that's going to appeal to a wide variety of folks around town. Wonderful. Well, again, we want to congratulate you on that new position. Thank you. And speaking of the 2012-2013 season, mm -hmm. a really great concert coming up with someone who's from our area. Absolutely. Chacon Clavarenga, who a lot of people around town know. She's a fantastic um, classical guitarist. She is currently studying at a conservatory in Ohio, Ohio but she's been playing guitar from a very young age. Uh, we'll be performing a concerto that's been written specifically for her. Wow. And she has a very interesting background because she actually has a couple of international championship titles behind her. She does. She's competed nationally and internationally. She has seven first place titles. Wow. Mm -hmm. So what kind of music will folks be experiencing during this concert? It'll be a really unique concert. Um, we'll be performing two of the Debussy Nocturnes. We'll also be performing Berlioz Symphony Fantastique, which is probably the most technically difficult piece the orchestra has taken on this season. Wow. Uh, and then the concerto itself has a wide range of styles that are integrated. The composer, Rene Schiffer, he's a Baroque cellist, um, but he also performs in a group Apollo's Fire and composes in a wide variety of styles. So you'll hear her classical playing, but you'll also hear a lot of other types of music in the concerto. Wonderful. And we'll get that information on our screen. Uh, this is going to take place Saturday, April 14th at 7.30 at the Long Center. And again, we have someone from our area who's coming back home for a wonderful performance. Of course, we all want to come out and show our support to yeah, her. Absolutely. All right. Thank you so much, Sarah, for coming in. Thank Appreciate you. Appreciate it.